And then so you got the seal pushed up a little bit or something. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe that's all it is, man. We'll see. Man, that stuff smells bad. It's horrendous. So Jay's digging into, uh, about to dig into that track drive motor right quick. Kind of see what the verdict is on it. I think the brakes are gone again on it. See that pile of bark right there in this windrow of dirt? Going Kevin's been shooting them trees out. I'm going to go over here and get the bulldozer right quick. I'm going to come down there and I'm going to push all that bark off for him. Get it out of his way while he's sitting out there. Because we're going to log this whole 70, 70 something acres right here. We're going to log the whole area from, from this one spot right here. So y'all hang tight. This is split into four halves, and I ended up saving that big thing. I think I'm going to set the camera on my loader here where y'all can watch what I'm doing and uh, watch me. Y'all get ready, here we go.
running the bulldozer is uh see that's 13 minutes total right there running a bulldozer is my least favorite thing to do come on there we go let's go i got it done it's not perfect but it's pretty good though it'll work for another week that looks a lot better over there now like i said it's not perfect but it'll work this 850 when things will push man they'll they will flat push Uh-huh. Hey, uh, this, this big main barn in here, there's a clean thing about how you get this uh, planter out. It's got the four big bolts, huh? With this. That's why they didn't tie them down before the problem. Brakes are alright this time, ain't they? Bearing. They have a piece of metal cut that seal. Probably so. What do he say about taking that apart? They ain't never done that before. <laughs> <laughs> Why does this stuff always happen to us, far I reckon? I don't know, but. Ah, uh, I heard it. Mm. The bad news. Yeah. He said that the race is made to the housing. Oh no, really? Oh no. Can you see which one it is in there? No, but see, you can see the big barns down in the bottom yeah. there. Yeah. That's going to, it's not going to be anything with the planetary, right? It's no, just going to uh, be the bearing in there that's making that noise. That so have you put anything on, on the, have you tried to break them loose yet? Oh yeah. Ain't, one inch. ain't touch it, huh? Mm. They're probably torqued to probably 20,000 foot pounds, probably. Oh, and got yeah. some Loctite on them, oh, too, yeah. I'm sure. They probably got stuff better than Loctite ever thought about being on that in that situation. Because right. could you imagine what that would do? That's what that pop was that Derry was hearing. Yeah. There once in a while. It sounded like it was just right here, is what it sounded like. You ain't gonna know till you get that cover off right nope. there. And they had never, they had never tore one of them apart, huh? Uh-uh. That's what Jody told me. Said, Have you ever took one of them apart on a John Deere? Pull, yeah. Pulled it off. See, if John Deere is different. Yeah. It has a spanner nut that you tighten down. Okay, so it don't have them four separate bolts in it then. Oh, uh-uh. Hmm. So it's got a bearing that's going to be on each one of them too, right? Yeah. And then it's going to have one big bearing that that whole, the whole thing sits in right there. Yeah. But you can see the ball down in there on it. That's oh, the yeah. Down I see them down in there now. Yeah. Yeah. And see. That thing's got some big balls, Jay. Yep. Watch up and think. <laughs> the thing on my idea, though. If it's got a place in that race, you gotta buy a whole hood. Oh, I know. I imagine that's very cheap. See, y'all see the final drive on the 830 there. Get on out of it. What ended up being wrong with it, it wasn't the brakes or anything this time. It was actually the, the big bearing that's in there that everything rides on. It, uh, it wasn't completely out. Y'all can hear it on the, as it was making the noise there, what it was doing. And so you can't, uh, we got another one. Uh, Dad went and picked another one up. They had it shipped in from Georgia. Tiger Cat did for us. And uh, Dad went and picked it up a while ago. So Jay will, Jay will start back on it in the morning, putting it back together. So we should have that machine back going 
uh, right after lunch. Uh, so it'd be Wednesday. Why y'all watching this video right here? So that'd be the deal on that. We'll get her back going and uh, and stuff. But that's not a tiger cat part. They don't make that. And uh, so I think they've had some issues on those things because we've had we've had some problems with them over the. Over the years since we've had that machine there, we've had some issues with it, with the track drive motors on it, and they've changed them out. Uh, each time, though, they've taken care of it and all that. Uh, this time, we're buying it this time. We're buying the, the track motor this time. Well, it's a gearbox is what it is, but uh, we'll get her back together. Derek's running the 726, so we really hadn't lost we hadn't lost anything other than just having to bring the 726 up here to uh, where we'd have it up here. So I'm about to head to the house uh, right now. I'm not sure how long this video is going to be with that dozer pushing in it, but that's some cool stuff, the dozer stuff in it. Uh, remember this weekend, uh, August the 4th is coming up. Man, we're closing in on it. Uh, got uh, going to be in Jackson, South Carolina. Just come up there to to anybody wants to come meet up with them and and all that stuff and shake hands and we're gonna do videos and just whatever else uh we can do i got some stuff i'm gonna be giving away while i'm there um be kind of like door prize type stuff you know caps shirts all that stuff like that truck parking big truck parking you can spend the night there if you want to out back they don't care uh, all handicap accessible. Nice place. They're actually uh, got contacted today. They're setting tables and stuff up. Going to get it ready for me this weekend. So it's going to be a uh, nice facility. If just one or two people comes up, it'll be a success. You know what I mean? Um, so I don't know what to expect or anything like that. But I uh, appreciate all y'all showing up day to day watching my stuff. Um, been 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 a cool ride life's good life is good it's no matter what goes on life's always good but uh with that being said i'm gonna let y'all go for now uh y'all be seeing some more tractor videos coming out uh shortly too but uh y'all be good be safe we'll catch y'all later later taters